Okay, welcome back to 15 Biomes Escape. Um, remember, if you didn't see the first part, I'll do a quick rundown. Remember, this was made by Block Vader. The link to the original map and their YouTube channel is in the description. Um, and yeah, let us continue with level 9, the nether. Hell. There's the fortress, there's another little thing, and this is a little... No, no, I thought I'd... I thought I had the thing, but apparently I didn't. What? What am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong? Three blocks should should be a possible jump. I get that it's not level. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe we'll start from the back going that way. Nope, that is not the solution. That is not that solution. Obviously, this is lava. We can't swim in lava. As I've tried to, like, six times. Come on. I can do this. I can do this. I gotta... I gotta... Give myself some motivation. Okay. Come on, Zelda. You can do this. Come on. Okay. okay. Motivation isn't enough. I know how this jump works. I know how you're supposed to do it. I'm trying to replicate it. That wasn't even a jump. That was just bad again on my part. I can tell these are entirely possible. These are possible to do, but I'm not... Amazingly skilled at parkour, so I can't time things properly Some of the time like once I nailed that ice parkour earlier. I, I did pretty okay. I Succeeded. Oh, there we go. Okay. I just have to think about that ice parkour to motivate me okay. That did not even work out. I keep thinking that maybe if I swim fast enough I can escape I keep thinking if I swim fast enough, I could have shoot. I, I keep thinking if I swim fast enough, I could escape and then do that. Okay. Replicate the jump again. I know we don't go from the very back. We go like a couple blocks from the block I'm supposed to jump from. That's what I think I've gathered from that. If I probably if I have to redo it, which I probably will. I definitely will. I think that's the theory. I think that's the solution. I think that's the solution. You're supposed to go like a few blocks. Yes. Okay. We figured it out. We figured out that one. So I think we can do that each time now. I don't think that block will give us trouble anymore. Okay. That wasn't even a jump, me. What was that, me? That wasn't even a jump. Okay. I'm going to keep trying. And once I get past the first and second... Once I get past this part and the next part, I'll come back to you. But I'm not going to be showing any more fails because I think that's just going to annoy people or make people not enjoy the video. Oh, well, we got one. Okay. Try number two with this jump. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're, we're good here. Okay. There we go. Okay, these jumps are a little bit more manageable now. Okay, I can do these. These are manageable. We'll come back to those. Okay. There we go. <laughs> oh. oh! Oh! Okay, that was weird. I didn't know you could just skim fire damage. Okay, I think we're at the home stretch of not having to be burned by lava. Oh boy. Okay, there we go. The power of the crouch button. Okay, and then... Yes! Okay. 
So now we'll just fall, and falling isn't bad. Falling's fine. I can handle falling. Okay, so I see something there. There we go. Lever and paper. Let's just jump. Finally. This one is done. We have completed this one. Thank goodness. Okay. That one took a while. We are on to the cave. I almost couldn't see that button. Stick. I'm assuming I'm just making different kinds of pickaxes, maybe? Supposed to go mining for the thing? Can I break that? I can't break that. What can I break? Obviously not the gold. Yeah, oh, there's cobblestone. Okay. Snap. More lava. We can't escape the lava, apparently. Okay, perfect, perfect. We made it across. Okay, this is going much better now. I spoke too soon. <laughs> Wait a second. I'm not even... How? Oh, that's how I got my cobblestone. I'm just dumb. I did that one spot. So I wonder because I got that cobblestone if I could add a furnace. I don't want a furnace. I want this stick to make this. So let's try something else. Let's try and get that iron um, instead of trying that parkour right now. I have... I did a lot of parkour with that nether level. Let's try something different this time. Um, I am going to try the gold for the heck of it, even though I know you need at least iron to get gold. Oh, we can get it. Okay. That works for me. If it gets the resource, it, it's all good. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to let this smelt and we will be back and see how this works. Okay, so I got the pickaxe, so now I'm going to try to go the other way. There we go! Can I possibly get this if I just jump enough times? Oh, I am. Jumping works. Okay. That's fun to know. We'll get the iron and then we'll do that parkour. That was a nice parkour break. I enjoy parkour, but that another parkour man. That was difficult. I I really struggled with that one. Okay. So that was all said and done. We have to get the get whatever there is on the other side because we made another pickaxe and I don't see anything else over here. So I assume that there's something over here that we're missing. So we have this. Okay, so now we do have to head... Shoot. We do have to go back. So we will be going back. I almost just want to jump in the lava. Just so... Well, I jumped in the lava anyway, so... Quick transportation. Okay, time to start mining the obsidian. And... Come on. Yes, finally. Okay, here we go. Level complete. Okay. We're on the last five. Level 11, the ocean. Fishing rod and redstone block. Renamed as red rock can be placed on a sea lantern. Okay. Oh, here's an area. Come on, 
don't drown, don't drown, don't drown, don't drown, don't drown, don't do the exact. Okay. We'll sell. We'll sell redstone block for fish. Okay, we have the redstone block. Oxygen helmet. Okay, so we have night vision and water breathing now. What's in here? Thoughts. Salmon is nice. Redstone blocks look like they fit nicely in the thing. It's that building. Redstone blocks look like red wool. Okay, so now we can see better. We have an ocean monument. There's the sea. There's some sea lanterns. I don't know if that's the correct thing though. There's another little hut that we haven't been in yet. It doesn't look like there's anything in here. Okay, so we have to get out of this spot. Come on. There we go. Okay. So are we going to be doing some fishing? So we have the red rock. I'm assuming we can put it in here. Okay, so sea lantern goes boop. I don't know. Let's try this little house thing. The door is open. It's a little maze. I like mazes. Mazes are cool. Is there anything in here? Oh, wait. Either I messed something up. There we go. Oh, wait. Okay. Gotta head back. Okay. So we need one more. So we need to do some fishing. I have barely done fishing in Minecraft, so this is probably going to be a disaster. I got a name tag, apparently. That's interesting. My fishing adventures have been something, all right. This is probably the most fishing I have done in Minecraft, like, period, honestly. A bottle of water? That's what I always wanted. We are at two out of five salmon. I've got three, just average fish, two salmon, a name tag, and a bottle of water. Which is interesting, I wonder how that gets on a hook for fishing. Four out of five fish, come on, one more. Just one more raw salmon and we can beat this level, come on. Guys, it only took me getting a bunch of um, name, two name tags, a bone, a saddle, a bottle of water, a trip wire hook, and a bunch of fish that I ate so that I could regenerate my health to get all five salmon that I need to get the red wool. Merman, please. Thank you. I am done here now. I think we have completed this finally, this level, and we can move on to level 12. did go in there. Interesting. Okay. Well, we completed that level. That's cool. We are going on to the beach now. Beach merchant, 15 fish, gets a stone sword. I mean, if we have to do some more fishing, fishing's pretty relaxing. I, I, I think the fishing was cool. It was easier for me to get the regular raw fish than it was for me to get salmon. So honestly, I'm okay with that. It fine, finally, that, that took quite a bit of, like, a decent chunk of my um, durability for my fishing rod. Okay, stone sword. Perfect. Assuming this is how you get the, um, sugar cane? Perfect. And, right, we make paper. Okay, from level 12 to level 13, and after that, we are almost done with this map. Swampland Marsh. I joined the darkness to um, that cave noise and it terrified me. Swamp Merchant, flower pot for a blaze rod. I can't see much here. Dust, glass, iron, axe. Do the axe with the flower pot? I can. Blaze rod, perfect. I don't think there's anything else I'm supposed to be. Oh, the nether wart. 
I'm going to try making the potion. I just want to try it. See what happens. Because theoretically, I could just do this, but I feel like that's cheating and not what I'm supposed to be doing. His name is Jimmy. I got a foot into hide. Slimy. Okay, I think we're good. We have potion of swiftness and a potion of leaping. So I think we can get through that little trial. I think it's going to be swiftness first and then leaping. Perfect, swiftness, leaping. I just go in here. Okay, second to last level, Mushroom Island. I'm assuming I see crafting table right there. Yep, a furnace with dark oak planks. There is a villager. I'll trade paper for a rabbit stew. Okay, so we need to make... Okay, so we need to make rabbit stew. Feel these crops, no stamping. Oh, I see a chest. I was looking for a chest and hoping that there'd be a chest close by so that I could get that. Excluding three, yep. Come on. Come on. Jimmy, oh my gosh, not Jimmy again. Wait. Oh, I got the other thing. Obviously it's not for this. Including three can break mushroom, mushroom wood. Well, that was... Okay, I got some mushrooms. I could also break wood. Not for the stew. No, I need wood. Oh, there's the wood. Then we'll make the bowl. I need the carrot and potato still. Wait, do I have to stamp on it? I do. I'm breaking rules. Rabbit stew. There we go. We have one. Hello, good sir. I have your stew for you. Take it. Paper. And we will be moving on to finally, 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 this last level. Oh, here's a chest. Video TNT. Can place on end stone bricks. Okay, so I don't know how to get up to those ladders right now. But I have seen that this block is end stone bricks rather than regular end stone, and this can be placed on end stone bricks. So it's already going. I don't know if I had to shoot it or something for it to me. Okay, so now I know what we have to do. We have to get the um, eye of Ender to make the end portal. Did I get this button somehow? Can I shoot this button somehow? I can, okay. That got us one. The ones I thought weren't opening actually were opening. It's just they're opening in a different area. Okay, that, now let's look for an entryway this time. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, found an entryway this time, which leads us to some ladder parkour. This last one. <laughs> wow. I'm actually proud of myself. I got that one on the first try. Yeah, and I already got the one, that one, so we'll just... Fall. <laughs> Much easier to do. Wait a sec. Uh, wait. Is there any other spot we can possibly hit up here before I go back down? I got it. Okay. 
it was possible. Okay, so we unlock that one and that one. Let's take a look. Okay, more par parkour. Okay, we are halfway there. Okay, that opened the door. I know I'm supposed to hit, I know I'm supposed to hit the slime block, but oh my gosh, okay. Oh boy. Perfect. Okay. I have under number seven. Okay, I see there's still more. Oh. Eleven. Now it's just this big tower and we beat the map. It's absolutely crazy. I'm assuming I'm allowed to do it this way or do I have to do it? I'm assuming actually it's done this way. Okay. Where do I go from here? Do I? Mm, I see where I go from there now, though. Come on. Okay. Okay, I'll come back when uh, we get that. Finally. We got all 12, but I can't seem to place them. It's not letting me place these eyes of Ender for some reason, so unfortunately I think we will have to go into survival mode to get this to work. There we go. Yeah, now it's letting me place them in. I don't know why I wasn't letting me do it before. And end. Okay, it's kind of funny how it gave me a redstone torch. It's because of all the other things. Oh, yay, fireworks! Ooh, we can fly now. Okay. We're in creative mode now, it seems like. We have completed the map. I will say, it, it was, I, I did struggle a little bit, but it was very enjoyable. It was a very enjoyable map. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to check out um, their um, remember to check out their channel and the map. It was really, really well made. They did a really, really good job. Congrats! Thank you for playing. Thank you, whoever you are for playing this map. I hope you enjoyed it. I really did. And I told your and, and tell your friends to play it. The map idea was started in 2015, but I got to building it in 2016. We once again appreciate you for playing this map, and maybe there could be a sequel. I don't know, but I love every single one of you for playing this map, even if you use the walkthrough. Oh, well, it was a very, very good map. I really enjoyed it. Like I said, there were some points where I struggled, but other than that, I, I enjoyed, it was really good. I enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video about this map, and I'll, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!